Well, it may be cherry blossom season in Washington, D.C., but drama is in full bloom in Potomac. Yeah, the Real Housewives <laughs> are back for season four, and the shade is cooler than ever as the drama heats up. Take a look. You're not going to paint me as the villain. I do. But she's living in my house. My wedding is my wedding. It's mine. We need to pay for the house or move out. Where am I kids? Karen is so phony. They're always running this mouth. Same Ashley Newley. You are broken. Their marriage is completely open. Who knows what their situation is? Do I have to hide? You're unhappy because Michael really don't love you. Her life is a mess. He was actually charged. Yes. With felony sexual yes. assault. Are you okay with what Michael did? I'm saying that it did not happen. You lie. Oh my goodness, I'm that's gracious. what I was thinking. And Ashley, well, happy Candace, Monday. Join right. us. It's <laughs> a great way to start the week. It's right? a great way to start We're the week. Excited. Hi, ladies. Yes. Hello, good Hi. morning. Hi. Good morning. Well, let's start off with uh, last night's episode. It was all about your big day, your wedding. I'm Congratulations. Married now. Yes. So exciting. Yes. Very exciting. <laughs> so, leading up to your wedding, there was some mama drama that you had. How is that watching back? It's when very, you're going through something like that. Yeah, it's hard to watch. When So we see the episodes, and then I watched it. It's six months after it's happened. I'm still crying. Like, yeah. I still, it still triggers me to, yeah. like, see some of that. Because a lot of it isn't resolved. We're still kind of working through some things. So, yeah, yeah it's, it's not easy to have to relive some of those really contentious moments. Yeah. 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 Well, and, you know, you joined last season. Yeah. But now you're an official... Wife. I'm a wife, wife of now. a housewife. Yes. <laughs> yes. So what's it been like kind of um, ch having your relationship so change as the cameras are watching? Um, it's, it hasn't been much of a change. I feel like Chris and I, my husband, my husband, we kind of <laughs> sat down together and decided we were going to be a team and really like use this amazing platform to promote ourselves, to be authentically us. Yeah. I think we've done a good job of, of really just being our crazy selves. I'm. I'm a little kooky, and I, I have to own that. Yeah, yes. <laughs> good. Yeah, fans are loving it. Yeah. Fans are loving it. Well, actually, let me ask you about Michael. Speaking of watching episodes back, will this be difficult for you to watch this season because you know he had sexual assault allegations? He was cleared of everything. Yes, he was. But now it's going to play out, you know, yeah. again. Are you going to watch it again? Is it going to be tough for you yes. and him? Um, I'm going to watch it again. It was it was difficult for sure, but it actually made my relationship stronger, and it showed me who my real friends are in in this group. So yeah. I really know who who's down for me. Oh, yeah. really? Who is that? Well, <laughs> so it shifted a little bit. Did it? Yeah. So people, you were surprised by who stood by you and who kind of did not. I was. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Nice tea. Yeah. Okay, we'll have to watch to find out. Yeah. yeah. Well, you know. People People always talk about how Potomac is known for some serious shade. Well, but Giselle um, was on Watch What Happens Live talking about how you and Candace, you and Giselle are now friends. We're getting to a better place. Okay, so yeah. so maybe not friends, but getting to a, on your way. You maybe? know, I, I don't want to get into like a, a title situation, but I will say that I think we got off on the wrong foot in the beginning. Yeah, and. I think that now that I've been able to kind of sit with her and understand who Giselle is, yeah. I'm in a better place because I, I get her. I see who she I see her for who she is. Okay. And and I can accept that. Yeah. She's, you know, I'm like I said, I'm a little crazy myself. Giselle has her moments. <laughs> she's she's a she's a nut. She's crazy. But I, we love her for her kookiness. Yeah. And and you can kind of embrace that. Kooky recognizes kooky. Kooky right? recognizes. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think it comes through with her too. I mean, that she is has true. she's she, had a lot happen to her in her yeah. life. People yeah. have she has been a lot of walls broken up. her trust. Yeah. 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 But what she said to me, we had a lunch, and she said something about you know, in my life right now, I just want to be able to laugh. Yeah, and that resonated with me because I'm in that place too. Yeah. Wanna just, you want to just have fun, just yeah. laugh and have a good time. Don't you want to all the time? Oh yes. Let me ask you about this baby coming up. <laughs> yeah. Taking a good time. Holistic approach, right? <laughs> yeah. How's it going? Um, it's good. I, starting out, I was like, this is going to be a breeze. It was great. I barely had morning sickness. Mm -hmm. As I'm in the eighth month, however, things are happening. I have my legs are swollen from wearing heels last night, yes. and and all types of things are just going on inside the body. Baby's kicking in my ribs 24 seven. Yeah, that's yeah. not fun. It's really not, and it actually hurts. And yes, it does. <laughs> yes, it does. It's real pain. Yes, it does. Yes. Two more yes. months, right? Okay, yeah. Come finish on. line. <laughs> all yes. right. Well, you're close enough. And thanks so much for stopping by, ladies. The Real Housewives of Potomac airs. Sundays at 8 p.m. on Bravo. Thank you, ladies. Thank you.